Did we decide what gauge wire that was? This is 22. Okay, 22 gauge wire. Because you can see how firm it is. You got to. Wow, you, yeah, you really have to poke it through. Okay, oh, this guy I, I killed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm just going to make okay, a U. Okay, that's an important technique, making that U shape. Okay, so then tape. And you might, you just have to put your finger at the top and hang on to it until you get it going. Okay. And of course, floral tape is, it sticks as you stretch it, but don't pre-stretch it. Stretch it as you twist it. So you're twirling and stretching. And stretching and getting it to just kind of hold the wire and the roots and the stems. And, you, and with your left hand, you're pinching and twisting. Yeah, succulents are heavy, so you want to kind of brace it. Uh-huh. And then you're just guiding it with a little bit of tension. Okay. I'm trying to expose as much of the root as I can. That's where uh -huh. I'm going to um, put the wire. So the pick goes right into the base of the stem. This one's this one wants to turn out just a little bit. Ugh. So actually, I'm going to get him started first because he was wanting really to turn. When you say turn, what do you mean? Well, see, his root's not very long, mm -hmm. so I don't have like that one. I had a little bit more to mm -hmm. pinch on to. Mm -hmm. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna get him going so it gives me something to grab. Got that pick right in there. Okay. And a chopstick works. Uh huh. Or yeah. or a rose stem that's been mm -hmm. pruned from a different arrangement. A woody stem out in your uh -huh. twigs that are straight and firm, just uh -huh. as long as it can support the weight of a heavy succulent head. Uh huh. And um, the heavy gauge wire, and then you're just you're binding them all together.